Oh yeah, what's up guys? This is Curtis Pike. My friends call me Banksy. I'm back in action. Today we're talking Starfield. We're talking Starfield launch date. We're talking about Bethesda. And basically some pretty good news for all of you guys that are eagerly anticipating this sci-fi RPG. And uh, yeah, another game that you guys all know about. Uh, let's get right into this. Jeff Grubb, gaming journalist at Games Beat, says Bethesda will be showing Starfield at E3 this year and it will launch before the year end. He even goes on and says that there is a 90% chance that they will have a full unveiling at the upcoming E3 for Starfield. This is great news if you ask me for anybody that's A, planning on playing Starfield, and B, pretty much everybody in the gaming world has been eagerly waiting for Elder Scrolls VI. Uh, we don't know the name of it, we don't know where it's gonna be taking place, but this means that it could be coming sooner uh, because yeah, if Starfield's down, then it looks like they're going to switch up and to spin up and go right on to Elder Scrolls 6. At least that's the current expectation. So I've got two questions for you guys. One, do you think that Starfield will be exclusive to Xbox and PC, as in the PlayStation 5 will or will not get it? I think they're going to get it, but again, I don't know. And two, how does this impact the release of Elder Scrolls 6? Do you guys think that this is going to speed it up? Do you think Microsoft flashing all their cash to Bethesda and buying them out with might have said, "Hey guys, uh, we want your first, we want a you know a first party studio, but we really want you to push the biggest game in maybe ever. Uh, let's move this forward and get this going." I don't know, guys. This is conjecture, but this is the latest news. Thanks for watching. I'll be back soon with some more stuff. Stay tuned.